Good afternoon, this is Sarah. I'm going to show you how to make a new Google Calendar Google Meet and how to copy the link from that Google Meet and use it in your email to your students and families or how to put it into a Seesaw announcement. So the first step is I'm on my Google Calendar and I've turned off most of my calendars so that it's a nice clean screen and we're going to make a Google Calendar appointment a recurring event just like you normally would. My first event I want to have occur on Wednesday, March 25th 2020 and I'm going to have it from 10 a.m. to 11 a.m. asking my students to stop by any Wednesday from 10 to 11 from now until we have resolved our current not in school situation. To begin I'm going to click on Wednesday March 25th and immediately I like to click on more options because I like to have all those options. For the title I'm going to call it Wednesday PLTW Office Hours with Mrs. Van Loo. I do not want it to be all day. I want it to be from 10 o'clock to 11 o'clock a.m. And I want it to repeat weekly on Wednesday. Next, I'm going to turn off my notifications because I don't want to get notifications for this recurring appointment. And finally, in order to turn it from a regular Google Calendar event into a Google Meet, where it says add conferencing with the camera. I'm gonna click the drop down arrow, select Google Hangouts Meet, and that's it. If I click save, I will have a recurring appointment on my calendar. I will show you what to do with that in just a moment. In the meantime, I'm going to go over to my PLTW PD class that I've made up just for doing screen recordings and running PD classes. And in this class, I'm gonna click plus add, and send announcement. I want to send this announcement to all my students and family members. As you can see right now, I have 14 made up students, one made up family member. There aren't a lot of people in this class, but it works really well for this purpose. So I'm sending it to all my students and family members. I'm going to type my announcement here. I've already drafted an announcement in notes. You can write your announcement right here in Seesaw, however. The next thing that I'm going to do to attach my Google Hangout Meet is I'm going to click Add Attachment. But first, I need to go into my calendar and I need to have a copy of this URL so that I can put that into my announcement. So I'm going to click Add Attachment. This is going to be a link and I can paste the URL that I just copied from Google Meet. Now I can press the check mark. And I know this looks good because I see the Google Meet logo. I'm going to press the check mark again. And at this point, I can either test the link or I can send it to my families and students now. I actually am not going to test the link. I would do that before I send this to actual students, but I know from practice that when I do that, it will open the Google Meet and I'll be recorded on camera and I don't want to do that today. So I encourage you to test the link before you send it to family members. I am not going to do that right now. I'm going to click send now so you can see what it looks like after the fact. Once I've sent it, my students and families will see a message that looks just about like this. If I send this to my real students and families, when families start to see it in the family app and students start to see it in the class app, their names will show up down here in gray underneath the message and I can get a sense of who has and has not seen that message. When I start to see names down here, I can actually click on the names. It will bring up a nice window in the middle of the Seesaw page and it will show me which which students and families have seen it line by line. So it's a great way to send out to your families. If you prefer to use school messenger or to use email, if you don't have as many connected families in your Seesaw, all you have to do is copy that link from Google Calendar and you can paste that right into the body of the message that you send using any other communication system. I hope this is helpful. Thanks for watching.